what's good, y'all, man? We got um, Morbius, uh, Trailer Tease, Easter, Easter Egg, Breakdown, man, Spider-Man, No Way Home, Venom, Rhino, Black Cat. My boy said um, it was Black Cat. He got Black Cat in there and Rhino. I ain't going to see this shit, like I told y'all. I watch Trailers, man. I just watch it as I watch it, like, long, you know, I ain't recording and shit, real shit, though. I do pause, like, on scenes, you know what I mean? Like, it's fire and shit, you know, like a scene he, he was like this, and the bullet, like, went up. That shit was fire as hell, I ain't gonna lie. But, um, yeah, though, but I ain't even know they had Rhino in the, in the bitch, in, in the black cat in that bitch. You feel me? I ain't even know. You know what I'm saying? But then that explains why, you know, that explains, though. Now now we know Rhino in the in the universe, and now we know black cat in the universe. Now, I never heard of black cat, though. I never heard of black cat, but I did, we did hear about Rhino, though. At um ghetto man, but the trailer come out tomorrow. So um ghetto man, it's gonna be a side in the mall. Can't wait to see the trailer. But um yeah, but hey, leave a like to my channel, my channel hit the bell new. And um yeah, let's get it. Going on guys, welcome to Everything Always. My name's Michael Roman. It's 2021, so we get a teaser trailer for the teaser trailer. We got new footage from Morbius today <laughs> with a brand new trailer, trailer coming teaser. tomorrow. And there is an enormous Spider-Man Easter egg besides the fact that Jared Leto ended the trailer with a web of opportunity, pun totally intended. The oh, I ain't even hear that shit. He said that shit? I ain't even hear that motherfucker. Rhino was mentioned by name. Damn, I missed a lot of shit, though. I just realized that shit. My, even, even my boy was like, hey, hey, you heard about Black Cat? I'm like, what? I ain't even see You feel me? Like, I missed a lot of shit. I told you, I just, I just watched trailers and... See why I see, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know, you know, I just I just watch how I watch it. So pop of that newspaper. <laughs> I do we pause the break down, down, but I'm not what like, this means for Morbius, you know. which universe he's in, which universe he's going to be in, and what's going on in this footage. Ain't like he's probably gonna be on Venom a Venomverse. Or I don't know what it is. But he did say universe though. I heard that shit. He said universe. So I don't know which one. I think I no, I think he'll be on Spider Man universe and shit. Probably um Probably the McGuire one or or the new one right now, Tom Holland. But um, it's, it's yeah. wild. I'm guessing a lot of this footage will be in the trailer tomorrow. We're gonna get a head start. Yeah, they give like basically like a sneak peek of the of the trailer coming out. So basically, probably the same thing as we see right now. Like y'all, you know what I'm saying? But there's more to it and shit like that. Break down everything in it. It actually looks really. Nah, that shit, that shit fire. When you like it. That's your hard though, man. I can't lie. Let me rewind that bitch, bro. Let me rewind that. We're gonna get a head nah, start. Nah, that bitch hard as hell, bro. In it. Uh, that bullet like light is really slow mo. Really but first, if you could grab the subscribe. And that angle, I like how he changes to a vampire into a human. Like he could change in and out. It's like Venom. He can change in and out type shit. I like that. Subscribe button. We're still giving away a PlayStation Five now at nine hundred thousand subscribers, as well as Disney Plus subscriptions, tickets to go see Eternals. If you want to be entered to win, all you have to oh, do yeah, hit the subscribe that. button, leave anyway. a comment down below, and if you want, stick around to the end Fire. of the video. We'll get into all the giveaway stuff again there. Okay, so seconds into this teaser for the trailer, right after Jared Leto starts his voiceover, we see the print daily. I ain't gonna see that. Shit. I saw all that picture, but I ain't look up like, oh, but I, can't, you, I ain't even look up like that. Man. Universe as Venom, let there be. I oh, yeah, the same shit too, yeah. Carnage before Tom Hardy's Venom is transported to what looks like the. Sometimes I have the urge to hurt bad The MCU, but take a look before Tom Hardy's Venom is transported to what looks like the MCU. But take a look up on top at the newspaper. Rhino on the loose, Zoo Hoax fools us all. Now, while the photo right to the right of it is meant to go with the other headline, doesn't it look eerily similar? The middle of the street where we saw Andrew Garfield fighting Rhino. Yeah, that's what I was saying, dude, kind of. Because that, that's what we saw him at. We saw Rhino supposed to be a part three, but they just fell through. It wasn't on Andrew's fault. It's just, you know, the studio, just they just fell through. They didn't want to do it no more. So it's supposed to be, you know what I'm saying? That's why they did a little cutscene. So I think this is supposed to be. With Andrew, because that's when we saw Rhino at Andrew um, Griffin, you know, Universe. You know, that, that Universe and shit. Now, Black Cat, I never heard of Black Cat. So, you know, give me news on that shit. <laughs> I know last now whether or not that's an Easter egg is one thing. Look at the headline right next to it. Black Cat, friend, or foe? I never heard of Black now, there Cat. There have been so many Sony Spider-Man adjacent properties in all various forms of rumors for pre-production announced. Sony Spider-Verse girls and Black Cat is important back in. Uh oh Okay. Unannounced, canceled, moved, unnamed <clears throat> films, and they just added two 
unnamed films in 2023, perhaps one of them, the Silver Sable and Black Cat film that was rumored to have already gone into pre-production that we heard nothing about, but here Easter eggs for both, setting this up to have a wide variety of Marvel adjacent characters to- So they gonna look crazy on the, on the universe. That's what's up though, that's, that's what's up son. Hey, go through it, no cap. Coming via Morbius, that's cueing Jared Leto's quote at the end of this, the web of opportunity. Now while a lot of this trailer is some recycled footage from what we saw from the first trailer, I'm assuming there's going to be a lot of new footage in tomorrow's take. And yeah, we already saw a little, little, little taste of it and that shit look little fire as hell. That little taste of the footage, new footage, that shit look fire than a motherfucker. I cannot lie, no cap. Let me know the comment. Let, let me know the comment below. Y'all like it too, but let me know the comment below. But that shit look fire as hell. Though. I, I can't. Look, I cannot lie. Okay. What I liked about the one when we got today was just how much brand new footage we got. Yeah, we got a lot of new what footage. His powers look like. On well, his powers look crazy, man. He can switch to a vampire mixed with, um, you know, and, you know, it's old stuff human. And you could tell he just got his powers because. On um, one scene, he was like, you know what I mean, a vampire, and then he turned back. He looked like, damn, I could do that, you know what I mean? So he was getting used to his powers, like, doing that scene, or that, you know, whatever, you know, how long, you know. And then you could tell he getting used to it by, the, you know what I'm saying, the cops, like, he shooting him, he know how to use his powers, and then by Cliff, you know what I'm saying, the rooftop, he, he flying and shit, I'm like, god damn, motherfucker, god damn. And I ain't gonna lie, man, it's my first time um, hearing about Mobius, Mobius too. I heard about them, but not like watching them, you know what I mean? I only got comic books, so it might be a comic book, you know, they got a name and this shit, but you know what I'm saying? But this shit, this movie right here is going to be gonna be hard. I, I, look, I cannot lie. This, this movie right here going to be too hard, no cap. Honestly, my hype level for this film went up a ton. Fad, it went, but my same way, Larry, and always, same way. <laughs> my bit, that bit went to here, right here, was like, hmm, to like, Oh, I'm dead watching this bitch. What will come out next year? In January? Sign me up. No cap. Like, real shit about this boy movie. It's so good, folks. That's good they did a trailer on this one. Same time I want the other trailer to come out. But it's good they did this trailer. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Predicated on just the action that we're seeing, he mentioned it was a transformative piece. For him, at least, physically demanding, but... Yeah, so look, look at his face. It went to this, and then to him, you know? A lot of the CGI looks really good there. Yeah, it do. The parts that make him look like he sort of... See, like he was vampire, and then to human, he like, ha! Ah. And then he is... Shifting like, into a vampire, yeah. and... I've been trying at it. Music unites us. And, you know, I'm up for this kind of take. I suspect it's going to be a lot different and more of a serious tone than Venom. And watching this action alongside a very dark anti-hero like Morbius, knowing that the plan is now eventually to have this character cross over with Spider-Man and seeing his powers the way they are. Uh, yeah, he said, he said universe, so he definitely going to cross paths. It actually okay. makes me super excited for it. And the rumored iteration of Sony's Sinister Six, if it's going to be built on characters like this. Oh, that's why yeah. That's sort of come off my, is Venom. Because they do guys a move of so-called, a move, I don't know what's true or not, but it probably is, though. They got they got their own in the six, so may, maybe it might be Venom, cause now you know it, it's their own one, so it might their their one might be Venom, Mobius, you know what I mean we don't know, it might be them too, and it's more you know like um, what's that called, Craven the Hunt the Hunter, you know what I'm saying they got more too probably yeah so going to be uh, in Spider-Man No Way Home, I've definitively said no, put them in the post credit scene. There's been a rumor that Sony wants their own Sinister Six to yeah, right, yeah. face they Tom Holland's own. Peter Parker and however that would happen. And I like the idea that it would be made up of a ton of these newer villains that have been introduced. Some in the... So they, yeah, they want their own ones. So that might be like, like I said, Morbius, Venom, and then got some more too. Or probably Ryan, I don't know, you know. Marvel Cinematic Universe, so, some in Sony Spider-Verse, but coming together and not the reboots that they're about to fight in Spider-Man No Way Home. We know who five of the six are. It would be Vulture, Adrian Toomes, who we saw already connected to Morbius in the first trailer. Then you've got Scorpion, you've got Tom Hardy's Venom, and the upcoming Kraven, which will be a little weird that that's played by Aaron Taylor Johnson, who was already Quicksilver, but Quicksilver died before he had a chance to... Oh uh, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, he playing. He playing two roles. I ain't know that till now. Like, no, not now. I've been there. I think. Yeah, I think I've been there. But yeah, but he playing two roles, man. He playing the MCU, the MCU role. Well, not really know because he died on, on the character. His character died. 
So Bracey, you playing, but he did play MCU, and then he took over to Sony side. Pretty much still MCU, but you know what I'm talking about. But yeah. It's to meet Spider-Man in the MCU, so at least it won't be that weird. That's five out of the six right there. And whether or not you bring back Mysterio, you don't necessarily have to. Another brand new villain, and there will be an updated Sony Sinister Six for Tom Holland's Peter Parker to face off against in the future. As we reported, was the plan all along since the remerger all the way back in 2019, over two years ago. Scoops here at the channel via Mikey Sutton. And they're all coming true now, all playing out in fruition. So while we do think that there is going to be uh, a Sinister Six of reboots and some sort, a sixth villain in No Way Home, it looks as though they're going to set up their own Sinister Six going forward, all updated and brand new. I have high hopes for Morbius. I wasn't too hyped to see this in the first place. I liked the first Venom more than I liked the second one. And I don't mind Tom Hardy's iteration Man, of that? Venom. Yes, I wasn't too hyped to see this in the first place. I liked the first Venom more than I liked the second one. And I don't mind Tom Hardy's iteration of Eddie Brock. I just don't read Venom as dark a character as I'd like to in those movies. It's pretty obvious that he's playing the protagonist and wants to be likable on some level. Hopefully Morbius, you know, listen... Well, a lot of people sometimes don't take Jared Leto's roles too seriously. We, what we know for sure is that he takes his own roles very seriously. And aside from some really bad choices that maybe you could blame on him and his agent for choosing because of the script, i.e. the Joker role, he's been good in some stuff. So maybe if he takes this seriously and it is sort of a darker read for a villain, it would be a fresh take. I'm, I'm for it. I'll at least give it a chance. And this teaser looks pretty good so tomorrow we'll of course break down all the easter eggs in a full trailer recap do a reaction as well make sure to check back at the channel for that and quickly let's get into all the giveaway stuff no nah, but now nah, mario's gonna look good though it looking good though you know what i'm saying we see um these pieces of the um, new content you know new footage and shit man but it look good though i fuck with mario's man the trailer made me want to watch it right now like dead ass we want to watch it right now though man but I can't, can't wait for the trailer to come out. See the trailer, well, the trailer, or the second trailer, and shit like that, man. Can't wait for that to come out tomorrow on the Tuesday. I, I know it'll come early as hell, because I think this one came early, like around 10, 11. Because, you know, um, yeah, though, man. But hey, leave a like, smash on my channel, hit the bell if you're new. Any of the questions, let me know in the comment down below, man. Let me know what y'all think about the Easter breakdown, man. Let me know y'all find these Easter eggs, or y'all, you know, um, or y'all just, you know, looked at it, he said, break down, and then y'all like, oh, right there. You know, so just let me know comment below. But, um, yeah, I'm out. And, um, yeah, all right, peace.